You're listening to The Alex Jones Show. Big Brother. Mainstream media. Government cover-ups. You want answers? Well, so does he. He's Alex Jones on the GCN Radio Network. And now, live from Austin, Texas, Alex Jones. All right, here's the deal. We've got massive Iran news, huge Rand Paul news, very important news on the rise of China, on the economy, and a new virus much more deadly than Lyme's disease. And folks, my dad got bit, bit by a tick and got sick from that. I've had family that's almost been killed by it. I mean, I'm scared of Lyme's disease, and that's a bioweapon. So we're going to give you the rest of the story on Lyme's disease coming up. And we've got several reports by John Bound and others that are excellent we're going to get to as well. But right now, I apologize for not going to the callers. Chris, Rod, Thomas, Ryan, Tim. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to go to you, have you make your point, ask your question, or disagree with me, or whatever it's going to be. Wide open phones. We're going to move to the next person. Chris in North Carolina, thanks for calling. Hey, Alex. How you doing? Hey, buddy. Hey, it's, uh, Chris yeah, you've got a phone problem there. Maybe our phone system again today. We had one yesterday. Can you speak right in your telephone, Chris? Right now. Let's put him on hold and see if that's our phone system. Uh, let's go ahead and talk. Maybe we should just suspend calls from now on or take them on our end. Rod in California. Let's see if that was Chris's phone or our system. Go ahead, Rod. Yeah, it's the, it's the GCN system. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to our backup system. And it's funny, in this new studio, I haven't moved our phone numbers in here. I don't use our backup enough to remember it. So do me a favor, run that in there and hang that up, and let's fire up the phone system in that studio, and there'll be more than one way to skin a cat. Uh, it's not John Harmon's fault up at the network. He does a great job. You know, John Harmon is vestigial, but a very important vestigial part of the operation uh, going back, I think, 14, 15 years, John Harmon's worked here. And he's actually now a manager and an executive up at the GCN Radio Network that does a great job. Uh, but um, by vestigial, I did this radio show out of my house for many years, like a remote. And so then I would say, go to the calls, and Harmon would sit there on a chat screen and tell me who the callers were, then he would air the calls. We can do the calls here. It's just that I like Harmon being there, and he, he does it. And it's a little bit different. Most talk show hosts have the control box right in front of them and actually do that. And, 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 and I have the capability to do that myself, but I do things a little bit different. In fact, you can say I do things a little bit of a cockamamie way because I got used to doing the show like a remote for so many years. I did it out of my house. From 99 to about 2004, 2003. Before that, I was in different radio stations. Uh, and so that's where that stands. But we'll get that GCN radio network system up. And uh, they'll probably have to reboot it. <laughs> we need to start testing it for the show. We can just do it right here on air the way we do things. Uh, but uh, we will take your phone calls today. And as I said, we will fire up the phone system in here and we will uh, let Rod and Chris and Tom and Ryan and Tim and everybody else have their first shot in on the phone system. So please don't call until they've been able to get in on the line. Then we'll open the phones up that way here today. But like I said, we have got a lot of news to cover as well. We're gonna look at the different criminal operations of the IRS with a former top insider a criminal investigator with the Treasury Department, the guy that, you know, had the IRS SWAT teams. And, of course, sometimes there were SWAT team and the mafia and the rest of it, but the media always phrases it like, if they're raiding you, you must be a criminal. Well, now it's more and more mainstream news and cannot be hidden uh, what's really going on. And what's really going on is the IRS is just an arbitrary criminal organization who doesn't even collect money to even pay off the debt now, it's simply to control the, the economy selectively and have a reign of terror over people. From Switzerland to Australia, people are now having to pay to put money in the bank as the globalists print so much uh, currency that it, it loses value. But at the same time, it's hard to get a loan uh, and the IRS will come after you over a few dollars. And it's, it's again, it's not about funding the government. They have unlimited fake treasury bills and all the rest of it. It's about squeezing the little guy out and destroying an independent, free, open economy. 
I'm Alex Jones, dedicated to overthrowing the tyrannical system, lifting the veil, and breaking the trance and getting folks out of the matrix. Introducing Secret 12, the new InfoWars Life Vitamin B12 formulation. Secret 12 is a binary of nutramedical grade, bioavailable coenzyme forms of B12, methylcobalamin, the same kind used in B12 injections, and adenosylcobalamin. Secret 12 is simply taken by mouth, right on the tongue, and then swallowed. No needles, no injections. Secure your revolutionary Secret 12 formula right now at InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. Alex Jones here. For the last two years, I've been working with top doctors, nutritionists, and chemists to design a nutraceutical formulation that has truly life-changing health benefits. Introducing the all-new Ancient Defense Herbal Immunity Blend. Experience the benefits of combining over 14 ancient herbs and extracts with exciting new advances in nutraceutical science. Visit InfoWarsLife.com or call 1-888-253-3139. That's InfoWarsLife.com. The experts are clear. Sunlight, purified water, healthy non-GMO food, and having a good attitude is essential to a healthy immune system. But I go further with Super Nascent Iodine X2 from InfoWarsLife.com. 50% stronger than our original and revolutionary nascent iodine formula, coming from a deep earth crystal source that no other supplier has. Most other forms of iodine come from seaweed in areas plagued by Fukushima and other contaminants. Not our iodine, it comes from over 200 million year old crystal salt deposits and is tested and proven to be completely pure. Visit InfoWarsLife.com today. See the informational videos. Read the information they're compiled. And for a limited time, when you use promo code NOW at checkout, you get an additional 5% off the entire family of InfoWarsLife.com products. Secure your Survival Shield X2 today at InfoWarsLife.com or call toll free 888-253-3139. Another major health threat, this one in Toledo, Ohio, where everybody in the entire city has been told not to drink the water. Ohio's governor declaring a state of emergency. Did you know that the average person uses about 80 to 100 gallons of water at home every single day? If there's a water emergency, will you be prepared? Panicked residents forming long lines throughout the day. We're here at a supermarket in Toledo. You can see the shelves empty where water once was. To stay safe and healthy during a crisis, you must must have access to safe, clean water. Water which will not be available at your local grocery store. There's a mad dash on right now to stock up on supplies. The ProPure Pro 1 G2.0 water filtration system is a must-have for every modern, independently-minded household. Protect your family's safety during an emergency. Go to InfoWarsStore.com today to purchase your ProPure Pro 1 G2.0 water filtration system or call 1-88-253-3139. He's the T-Rex of political talk. Alex Jones on the GCN Radio Network. All right, the Genesis phone system is having some hiccups today. That happens a couple times a year. And it happened yesterday, it's happening today. So we're going to be on the in-house system uh, here in Austin, Texas. And that number is 877-789-ALEX. It's the number you call on Sundays where the show is 100% produced here in Austin, Texas. 877-789-ALEX. 877-789-ALEX. And it's on any subject you want to raise or talk about that we've already gotten into in the first hour. And we already covered a lot of it. The VA, quote, makes little headway in fight to shorten waits for care. They were ordered to put people on no treat list as part of eugenics and bioethics. The decision is made not to give them the care to set that precedent. The VA are the ones running it. Of course, they haven't fixed it because it isn't broken. <clears throat> we can talk about that. CDC, U.S. heroin deaths nearly triple in three years. They blame Mexico. When you can go to Interpol or NATO and they admit 93% of it's coming out of Afghanistan, worldwide. Just a lie from the White House, preying on a stupid public. Unbelievable. Jamie Dimon warns next crisis could see more volatile markets. Oh, that's the head of J.P. Morgan Chase at the top of the New World Order with Goldman Sachs. 
I mean, you don't get higher up on the pyramid of these parasites. This is like a fox telling the farmer, you know, there may be a weasel or a fox or something that's going to go in your hen house and eat your hens. I mean, yeah. This is like Hitler saying, you know, we might actually invade some countries or kill some people. I mean, it's just unbelievable. Saudi Arabia to borrow to finance soaring deficit. They're one of the biggest oil producers in the world, second biggest. They have sweet crew. that They get it out of the ground for like $5 a barrel, and then are able to refine it for something like $12 a barrel. It cost Venezuela $102 a barrel. The U.S. something like $75 a barrel last time I checked. And they can't even run in the black. Oops, I was just racist. Let me stop right there, and then I'm going to play a special report and go to your phone calls. I have an article here in my stack that when I read it this morning, I had to read it three times to even make sense of it. You know the little modicons or whatever you call them? They're called something else when it's an Apple-based system. Emoji. <clears throat> Emojis, the little smiley faces, the little, if I want to meet friends after work for a beer every once in a while, I'll send them an you know, emoji or emoticon, whatever they're called, of a beer. If I want to go fishing, I'll send my buddy a shot of a kayak and a fishing pole. Like I ever, I haven't done that in like three years. I need to go out and have some fun. Then I'll be harassed by the lake police, though, if I try. I just, the country's gone. I'm sorry. Excuse me, but the border's wide open, right? Clorox apologizes, deletes tweet after racial uproar. This is how politically correct and, and mentally ill the general public is. Clorox complained that out of hundreds of these symbols, on the new iOS 8.3 for iPhones and Apple systems in the chat and text systems that Clorox wasn't an icon of hundreds of other products that are listed. Because now they're listing products. And because it was white, they're claiming it's some type of racial code. And guess what? They did the right political correct thing. They apologized. Brown bags in Seattle are racist. No one ever said they were connected to racism. No one ever said they, they were a symbol of bringing your own lunch. Because a brown bag is strong paper that's flexible, lightweight, and inexpensive. It's untreated paper, which makes it weak and makes it more expensive. Unbleached. So bleached paper is racist. Unbleached paper is racist. Saying I want Chinese food is racist. Saying I went to the Chinese New Year fireworks display in New York is racist. You gotta say Lunar New Year. In Europe, they've changed the names of more than 20 species with black in the name for birds. Black owl, black warbler, black lark, black starling. You know why they're called black? Because they're black. You know, when you say a red bird, a cardinal, it's not because you're racist against the color red. The bird's red, folks. The male of the species is red. That's when I go down to the Gulf with my son and catch red fish. It's just a red drum. Baby, we're calling it red because it's red. And when we catch a black drum, we're calling it a black drum because it's black. This is how mentally ill. See, we all know how to obsess over paper bags and Clorox, but not 51 to 52% of black people never being born. Or Planned Parenthood giving awards to Hitler and getting awards. My head is literally spinning at this point. And I read this article and I kept looking, where's the tweet? Where's the bad? And it was just like, Hey, Clorox ought to get added to all these products. We want to be an icon. Taco Bell launched a similar but less controversial campaign earlier this year in an attempt to rally support for taco symbols in the Apple emoji lexicon. And then it goes, so you have campaigns to get your your symbol listed, like I guess the Groucho Marx nose and glasses means I'm going in disguise, come to the Groucho Marx glasses nose party. 